Are you ready for this? I'm so ready, darling. People want us to do this. Then let's give it to them. Welcome, Welcome back, back to the, the channel. channel. You guys have sent us so much fan art ever since we first posted on TikTok. Some were breathtaking and will be used for the next episode of the podcast. And others? Well, Voxy here told me that they were Eddy. Edgy. He meant edgy. But yeah, some of them were pretty bad. But we didn't want your work to go to waste one way or another. Even if it's weird as fuck. One minute has not passed yet, darling. Remember? We need to get monotazed. He meant monetized. But yeah, we're still in the process. So we need you lovely little internet people to scrub, scribe, nuke, and share the video. And now, let us begin reacting to your Eddie fan art. Actually, before we do, there's someone I want to introduce you to. Someone wants to meet me? How charming. Who is it? A meme has been floating around the internet lately, and I think the fans would be interested to see your reaction. Well, don't keep me waiting. You know it's been quite a while since I've met a holy f***ing shit. Editor, bleep that, please. We need money to keep this channel running. That is the most adorable creature I have ever seen in my life. Adorable? Seriously? Look at that thing. That thing has a soul, one that I will not claim. Instead, cherish and shelter. Well, that soul also has a 3D version that one of our fans sent us. Don't be foolish, my darling. Moving an entity to a third dimension doesn't change its appearance, let alone elevate. Let me guess. Cuter? I don't think I've ever seen something this breathtakingly beautiful. Well, people sent us a lot of images like that. Everyone wanted to know if you've ever seen it before, and well, here is the Call my cat it one more time, and I'm gonna f*** you. First of all, don't threaten me with a good time. What in the actual f Second of all, it's a meme. It looks like you. I shouldn't have been surprised that you like it. I'm just not a fan of small things. Trust me, my darling. I know better than anyone else that you are not a fan of small things. Can we just move on to the other pictures? This is not the time for fan feeding. I will be keeping this radio cat with me, and I would like her to make an appearance in the future arts we will receive for Radio Static. Okay, so do you remember this image? From the group chat video? Yes, I remember. Well, what do you think of this one? If you're the creator of this art and you're watching the video, you will not be getting my delicious jambalaya. Also remember that I'm immortal and you are not. With that being said, I will patiently be waiting for your arrival in hell. I don't know about you, but I think it's a very cute picture. While we're at the topic of pregnancy, why don't we address your labor? Can you just get that picture away from me? What seems to be the problem? I thought you found images like these cute. Oh yeah? Well, how's this? Oh my goodness. Yeah. That's what I thought. Is that Butterman? Excuse me? Butterman! The man with the butter! Are you talking about Butterdog? Butterdog is Butterman? What? No! Does the Butterdog have a Butterman? What are you talking about? I need to know who had butter first! Can we just move on to the next image? Fine! But we are going to talk about this tonight! I never actually understood this trend. I don't know, maybe it's just a preference thing. The one on the right looks very charming, if I do say so myself. Why am I not surprised? Speaking of surprise, there was actually one other image that caught me off guard. Let me see, I'm sure I can explain everything. What in the name of Teletubbies t is that? In fact, there was so much happening that I couldn't really process the image nor develop an opinion. It's one of those pictures that contain a lot of trendy words that I don't quite understand just yet. Alster, darling, can I be honest with you for a moment? Of course, my dear. What is it? I think it's better for your sanity to not find out what any of these gestures or words mean. Not even this one? Trust me, especially not that one. I also found this image in the mailbox. It appears, though, that I'm consuming a soul while you are crying. Not sure I quite understand the so-called trend. Yeah, well, if you interpretate eating someone with bad, nowadays that's kind of a kink. If I'm following you correctly, you're essentially stating that people find the process of being consumed enjoyable. Yeah, well, just like art, there are different kinds of people that have different kinds of preferences. Are we allowed to judge them? Sadly, not anymore, no. Are we at least allowed to judge the art? Like this one? What the f*** is that? Radio Apple. People have been talking about it for ages. It's basically the fans wanting you and Lucifer to be together. In that case, allow me to put this in simple terms. His cane is too short. I don't know. I kind of think you two look good together. And by the way, credit where credit is due. That artwork is amazing. Not a single droplet of doubt in my mind, my dear. The styling and the art itself truly is astonishing. That's just sad that it is used in such a manner when it could have been used for our podcast. We have a lot of those examples, by the way. Like this one was sent to me at 4 a.m. And the first thing that came to my mind was the word why. Why make something this beautiful this bad for YouTube to see? 
Excuse my curiosity, my dear, but why are our underpinnings blurred? Because we need monetization to keep videos in production. And let's just say YouTube doesn't react well to images like these. I understand that part very well, my dear. However, there seems to be a misunderstanding. I don't have feet. I have deer-like hoofs. And even if I were to have human-like feet, I struggle to understand the appeal. Trust me, there are images that are a lot worse. Would you mind providing an example for that statement of yours? Gladly! How's this for an example? Is this supposed to be bad? This is just another one of our Saturday nights. The same night that we spent fun- Okay, okay, point taken. How about this one? Again, I fail to see the problem. In fact, I would say that this image would be a worthy contender for the podcast. You seriously don't see the problem? Look at it from a visual standpoint. Just a moment, please. All I see is you leaning forward, looking back at me as I appear to be stretching with my- Holy sh I see it now. I know, right? Look at this one. So this is radio static. If you're talking about us shipping, then yes, this is the true definition of radio static. We got loads of those kinds of pics. There's actually an interesting fact that I don't quite think you've noticed. Really? What's that? The images that we have reacted to so far. And by the way, I'm talking about shipping types of images. They seem to be demonstrating the fact that I am the so-called dominant one. Where the f*** did you get that image? I have my ways, darling. Oh yeah? How about this? Who's the dominant one here? Who's on top? F you. Not yet, you won't. You'll just have to wait for the evening. Can we just move on? I actually have something I want to show you. Are you talking about this? You dude, no! Where the f*** did you find that image? I've said it before and I'll say it again. I have my ways, darling. Hold on, it, it was John, wasn't it? John, who is John? Don't play dumb with me, you jazz-loving, no f***ing back-rubbing mother- Okay, fine, it was John. I knew it! So what did you want to show me? Look at this guy. This is the cutest thing I've ever seen in my life. Your flat ass didn't really live a long one to begin with. Since Alistair requested for that weird rabies having cat to be included in the future drawings for the podcast, I think I have the full right to request for Flatfin to be included in the arts as well. First of all, the f*** is Flatfin. Second of all, while you're waiting for people to add your f*** fin to future artwork, I already have mine right here. Seriously, John, what the f***? You're gonna do this to me after I let you stay at the V Tower the other night? Anyway, you know what I've noticed? The bulge on my pants? Besides that. The love letter I sent you this morning? Oh, for crying out loud. The pictures! Did you like them? I put a lot of thought into taking- Can you just shut the f*** up for 11 and a half seconds? Understood, sir. Lovely. As I was saying, it has come to my attention that a lot of images we have here simply don't belong in this type of video. Actually, now that you mentioned it, you make a very solid argument. I don't think any of the art that we're showing right now is edgy or weird in any sort of way. In fact, I think they're quite good. That is something I definitely agree with. A look at this one! Simply breathtaking! I know that image. The person was sending us letters for like a week straight. Honestly, credit where credit is due. They may not fit the criteria for the next episode of the podcast, but that doesn't mean that they're low effort and bad pieces of work. Even if some of them are low effort, that doesn't mean we won't show it off. None of the images that we have just showed are weird in any sort of way. In fact, some are very funny. Okay, let's save the funny and cute ones for the end of the video. Sound good? Allow me to ask a simple question. If you were to move us to the real world, what would we look like? This is the first image that popped into my head. Is that us? I mean, it's supposed to be. That's definitely not what I had in mind. I have another one, actually. And honestly, this one kind of looks like you. Excuse me? I am a Wendigo! A cannibalistic warrior. A creature with no mercy. And not a deer. And I don't give a deer f about what spirit animal you are! Go f yourself. Only if you watch me! That's my line! Shut, Shut up, Angel! F you guys! And besides, why do you have piss cord on your face? Seriously, dude. Where do you come up with those weird names? Never mind that. Look at this! Holy sh What is that? That's basically us in real life. Yeah, but what's with the art style? What do you mean? It looks fine. What's wrong with my head? Actually, I think you're right. I think it's too small. It doesn't capture your fat ass forehead. Do I look that flat? I mean, I can't even imagine what I look like from the side. Actually, I can show you. I don't think I want to look at that. I told myself the same thing when we first met, my dear. Now that I think about it, realistically speaking, that's actually what we would look like. Perhaps so. However, I don't think I would look that fat. You think that's fat? That's not fat. Now this is fat. First of all, what the f***? Second of all, why is the middle part of my body blurred? Someone placed a logo that YouTube does not approve for us to show. Third of all, two can play that game, mother f***er. The f***? What is this? Inflation. I think you'll find yourself quite familiar with the concept. It could be worse. Excuse me? I'm being serious, it could have been a lot worse. 
Could you provide a more detailed explanation? Look at this one. A picture done by an artist that could have made a masterpiece. So just because it's not you, it's shit. Of course not, it's shit because it's you. I'll be keeping that picture, and I'll also be taking my body pillow. This again? Just because the comments say that I have a body pillow of you, doesn't mean that I actually have. I hate John for this. He also sent me this one. Motherfu- Tell me, my dear, is this really an image made by a fan? Or is this the night you went out to record with Valentino? Before I answer that question, could you tell me what this is? What the f Wrong image! Is this from your gallery? Just swipe to what the other this? side! Secret stash? Damn these Did you draw that? Those are not mine! Dude, you're I swear openly this is leaking not your whole gallery like. to me! I'm not leaking what the it! What is that? Don't look at that! I can't look away! I can explain, I Was swear! Cut the camera! You spying, Cut the camera! Okay, I think we're recording again. Let's just agree not to speak of this on camera. Yeah, you have a good point. A lot of people will be watching this on the premiere, so... Let's just calm down for a minute. I could most definitely use a minute or two. So, else I'm listening, Vox. Any fan art left? Only a handful. I don't need to show any form of disrespect or offense, but it looks as though it was drawn by the younger generation. I got a couple of those as well. Only difference being that mine are 1080p quality, and you can actually see some details. I remember that image. In fact, I recall getting spammed with that same image on our Gmail. I'm going to move on to the last one. Again, I don't know exactly, but it looks like a kid drew these for us. Which is not to say that they're bad. In fact, the whole point of this video was to see the edgy side of the fan art. Congratulations on saying the word correctly. Congratulations for giving me permanent trauma and brain damage. Speaking of damage, this is the last image that was left in my phone. I just wanted to show you to make sure that you knew everything. I think I need to go talk to someone. You can always talk Get to me. Get the f away from me. Well, on that note, I think it's time to end the video and roll the bonus fan art. I think that would be best for all of us. Is there anything you would like to say? I hope you keep yourself tonight. To the fans watching the video. Oh, sh Sorry, guys. I'm sure they understand. Scrubscribe to the channel, nuke the video, send to your friends, and please, when you submit the fan art, put your trick truck or social medium on it. That way, people can see it, and you can have credit for your own artwork. We are getting a lot of images lately, and it is becoming difficult to give a shout out to every single one of them, so if you can, put your social media on it, and if you don't want to, obviously that's fine as well. We love you all so much, and we are so thankful. Now, if you'll excuse me, I need to wash away for a couple of hours. We have a lot of work to do, and let's just say, my mental state is not really ready for more of this. If you guys haven't watched our other videos, go ahead and check them out. You guys watching these videos till the end really helps support this channel. Thank you so much. Now, if you don't mind, I would like some alone time. Yeah, me too.